my mother dreamed of red silk and gilded bird cages gleaming in the sun. There are gaps in her history, pages torn out, whole dynasties flourishing and falling without notice, secrets buried in the crevices by the riverbed. Her fractured villages united in bloody battle, last resistance beaten, last soldier dragged to the open square. They speak the same language, yet curse in their own tongues behind wooden doors. She tells herself this is progress and pushes on. There was a time she would not have cared. She ha would have wandered a misty hillside, lingered by the singing stream, quoting Lao Tzu, re reciting Li Po, content to let others deal with mundane matters of state. She would have dreamed she was a butterfly. Now she does not remember the freshness of the pond, the one lily floating. She is high above the earth in a lofty apartment with its suited windows and airless rooms. Clouds choke with smoke from immense factories where sewing machines drone day and night. Her callous hands no longer feel the tender wings of hummingbirds, the soft suckle of a baby's lips. Great walls surround the city and she cannot see the horizon with her emptied eyes. Dream becomes an opera, a bow to Kuan Yin, a dance in a courtyard, my mother in a rice field chasing memory. Yeah. Okay.